Glub, glub, glub. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We have bombs now. We can, we can open this. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Blindly Play The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening with Mio X Fu. And we just found a fairy fountain in the nick of time. Ugh, close your eyes and relax. <laughs> well, I mug you. <laughs> you wake up in the alley. The contents of half a fairy bottle just all over your shirt. Your wallet's missing. Goron wallet, which you spent like maybe like half an hour saving up the rupees so you could get it. <sighs> Things that fairies get up to these days. Aha! <laughs> that was late. That was. Oh, that was close. Ooh, a raft. Do you want to challenge the river rapids on a raft? Proceed to the office at once, please. I do. <laughs> Want to go on a raft ride for a hundred rupees? <laughs> no. Are you kidding? I've been spending, I've been saving up this money for far too long to spend it on a raft ride. Maybe once I get the bow. But even then. I don't even know if I'm gonna get anything out of it. Or if it's just gonna be like... Well... You're at the bottom of the river now. Have fun! Ooh, I wonder if it's in here. I got a piece of heart. That's pretty good, too. Not finding any necklace, though. Yeah, don't see a necklace. Anyway, for those of you who may not have heard, we're on the search for a mermaid's necklace. And in exchange, if we find that necklace, she'll give us a piece of her scale. From her tail. Oh yes, indeed she will. Oh, I can just use Mambo's, uh, Mambo's magic, can't I? Turn into a termite. Oh! <laughs> Best song in the game? I think so. Well, we haven't heard, we haven't heard all the songs now, have we? But so far, it is quite good. It even beats out uh, dungeon music number number three. Had to think for a second. How many dungeons have we done already? <laughs> I don't know. You think I keep track of these things? Oh, jeez. Didn't mean to do that, but whatever, I'll jam out to it. <laughs> oh, by the way, I meant to mention this uh, last episode. You might have noticed that with my superb video editing skills, I added backgrounds to every episode that change as I go from area to area. While this was cool for the first few episodes, it takes a while to do. Uh, more, m longer than I'm really Longer than I actually want to put the effort in, for little to no return. Again, it was kind of cool the first couple of episodes, but I'm, I'm pretty much done. There'll still be a background image, don't worry, it's just, it's gonna be static. It's not gonna... Yeah, yeah, yeah. heard this song before, whatever. <laughs> it's not going to change over time. What do we do with the persimmon again? Do we... Uh... Yeah, I am Shodanovich. Oh. Is 
So he built the mermaid statue. Hmm. Oh, so we were supposed to bring her a hibiscus. Yeah, listen. I would like you to take this letter to a Mr. Wright who lives on the border of the mysterious forest, please. Sure thing. We got a goat's letter. Great. <laughs> also, I noticed they have, uh... They both have similar birds. Hmm. Whoa. Jeez. Yeah, yeah. Come on. <laughs> this isn't even fair anymore. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Could your necklace be down here? Whoa. Maybe. May nope. No, no, get it. Hmm. Why do I even try? L statue, tell me. Secrets are like water when it comes to bridges. <laughs> I love these. <laughs> the hints are the best part of this game. Oh, man. Damn it. Oh, no, no, I know your trick. You piece of crap. Get, get out of here. Damn it. <laughs> oh, Rira, give me a hand, please. Bring, bring. Hey, it's old Rira. The catfish's mouth is wide open. It sounds like a great place to dive. Buy and click. Can we just go into the catfish's dungeon? Oh, thank God, I got Oh, God, I got this. I got Trixie's secret or whatever. Whatever, I forgot about that. Oh, my God, I thought I was done for right there. Well, let's see if we can actually go into the uh, catfish's mouth and stop wasting our time. Because, hell if I can find her necklace right now. I mean, I was gonna try that in the beginning, but I'm like, no, there's a rock there. That wouldn't work. I should've tried. Anyway, level five, Catfish's Maw. This is some fantastic music too. Oh my God, the dungeon music in this game. Who did the composing for this game? Because it's better than any Zelda game. For at least for music. I, I'm absolutely 100% serious. So far the music has been phenomenal for most of the songs. And it's absolutely blowing my mind. Like, I don't usually pay attention to music that much in games. And I'm paying attention to the, to the music now. That's how big of a deal this is. Uh, we can't make that. Ooh, maybe we'll get Rock's Cape this time. What I think we'll probably end up getting, if these guys are any clue, is some sort of magnet mitts or whatever. Magnetic oven mitts! Never drop a pot again! <laughs> Yeah, 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 a new feature that we've heard four times before. There we go. Okay, I wasn't sure if it was gonna drop a key in the middle or what. Oh, oh, oh. I need that. Whoa, 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 that's a lot farther than I thought it was gonna drop at first. Jeez. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Here I am thinking that logic will be used. Whoa, no, this is actually really hard because they drop a lot faster than you're expecting. But I can just skip the last one, so. Hmm. 
<laughs> tricks. I've got some nice tricks up my sleeve. Oh, that was easy. Okay, so there's treasure in here somewhere. Question is where? I see how we I see how it is. Just gotta follow the pattern in the other room. Here we go. Mm, maybe we push these up. Sure is giving me a lot of health, which is nice. No. I can't push these. Well, no. I'm gonna try the only thing left to me. I've tried pushing them every other way. Can only push them in. That's stupid. I mean, you'd think it would be based on this, but no. That's really dumb. Can't even... Okay, now big question. Can we go back to the beginning of the dungeon? Or is this gonna really screw us over and bring us outside? No, okay, it brings us to the beginning of the dungeon. That is really helpful. Uh, everything comes back to life, though, so everything resets. So it's it's limited usefulness. Although I don't think we've got any revolving platforms that we have to worry about, which would have made this it, it would have been much handier in a dungeon. Again, that they would have had in Oracle of Seasons or of Time, but hey, whatever. Or no, it wouldn't have been useful. Sorry. Because <laughs> it does reset the dungeon, so... Well, let's not go that way yet. Ooh, we don't have the beak yet. Can we just run... No, we cannot just run through. But we can take care of you guys pretty easily. Whoa, whoa. I did not want to take care of a mini-boss already. But didn't we fight this guy already? Oh, please do not... Tell, tell me we do not need the item. Okay, we need to use bombs, I guess. I was going to say, please tell me we do not need the item that we get in this dungeon. But this works too. Arg, I can't beat you. I'm out of here. <laughs> okay. Oh, so these are rooms where we have to fight him. Aha. Uh -huh. I've got what was inside this box. Come and get it if you can. Master Skill. That bastard. He doesn't know who he's messing with. <laughs> That's cool, though. I like that it's not just like, oh, it's a box. Get an item. <laughs> also, again, still love the playing with the Mario ideas. 
Only more Zelda did that. But then I guess it was the first Cap. It was the first game that uh, Capcom did with Zelda, so I guess they could get away with it just because they couldn't be told no. Well, they could have, but Nintendo probably didn't think to tell them no. Okay, so mm, not a lot we can do here, is there? <laughs> Oh, I thought that was going to shoot fireballs or something. You know, like an actual Bowser head. Oh well. I am completely lost right now. And I have no idea how we're doing for time. God damn it, that was an arrow. I should have arrows, but I should have a bow by now. That's what that's telling me. What? So I might need to actually leave, go get a bow, and come back. I don't like that. Okay, we're back here. Alright, so after we clear this room... Oh, nope. Maybe not. Depends on how much of a job, how good of a job I do killing myself. After we clear this room, I'm going to see you guys next time on Let's Blindly Play Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening with Mio X Fu. I know. Huh? Alright. I'll see you guys next time. Let me kill these guys first. Oh! I don't want to stop. Uh, uh. Oh, you know what? We can trap this guy. Ah! No! <laughs> you weren't supposed to do that. You're supposed to go the other way. Oh, well. You know what? I'll see you guys next time. Bye now. <laughs>